How do I keep chipmunks out of my garden bed? Thank you. This is Sandy from Chattanooga, Tennessee. Yes. So, Miss Sandy, we have somebody that struggles with chipmunks. Yep. It's Joellen, so yeah, we listen to Joellen see what she has to say. I, I have chipmunks in my, have I, I moved my garden, I made a raised bed, and now the chipmunks are trying to grow underneath it and on top of it. But, they, <laughs> but I fooled them. There's wire mesh underneath the, the raised bed, so they can't come up through the bottom of the wired mesh. Okay. But... But <laughs> they still come in there, and you know my dogs chase them. Um, but I, I, you know, I think once I start moving around and digging in there, I think that will make them go away. Make them go away. Yeah, think? I think they're they've just moved in in the the summer during okay. the summer, when you know I'm letting everything grow, and there's a lot of foliage, you know, with melons and squashes mm. and tomatoes right. and and green beans and cucumbers and all of that. So they thought they're probably thinking they're in a nice jungle home. <laughs> well, when you know they start ripping up the garden for the yeah. end of the season, there's not going to be any cover for them. Yeah. And mm -hmm. I think that will and, and the disturbing of the soil will make them leave. Disturbing of the soil. What and do you, you think about that? You could trap them too, but you could trap them. What do but, you think about that, Doc? Would you? Well, would you right exactly where we are, okay. where I live, right. we do not have chipmunks, but we got squirrels. <laughs> so it's, you know, I know chipmunks kind of burrow and do things, which is a little different than a squirrel, but they dig. All they, are, all they like to dig. And they eat up your little roots and bubs and things sure. and whatever, you know. So I, I'm like, you know, I wish trapping would be effective, but you can trap and do something with them. But there's just going to be more yeah. if the environment is right. Like you're talking mm -hmm. about, they yeah. have cover and you've got food for them that they're going to be wanting to get after. But there are products you can do, but how effective they are, yeah. I don't know. Yeah. You know, I read about one that I'd never read about before. It's called Bitrix. You ever heard of that? No, I've never, never heard, heard of that one. It is the most bitter Bitrix, compound bitter. known yeah. to man. Okay. It's not that bits, you know, what is that, that a currency that's called Bitrix or whatever? It's not that. It's B-I-T-R-E-X. Okay. And it's the most bitter compound. It's in a lot of different deterrents. Hmm. So the, the theory is, you know, they eat it and then they get, yeah. you know, and then <laughs> they don't go back, you know. So I don't know. You know, I don't know. I have never heard of that. And then there's, you know, the stuff you read about for squirrels and things is like cayenne, yeah, pepper, yeah, garlic, yeah. human hair. I don't know how effective all that is. It's just temporary. Right, yeah. Just temporary. So, right. yeah, it is just yeah. temporary. That's all it and is. <clears throat> putting the wire down, mm -hmm. like you said, you know, that's a lot of work, but, you know, it's just how much you're willing to tolerate. You know, I the think that's the, the key to these yeah. nuisance critters. It's just, you know, your tolerance level. And people get, I, I get really that. frustrated, you know, with things eating up my pretty plants. All right. You know, but it's just part of gardening. Just part of it. Yeah. Those old chipmunks. Yeah. Bless I mean, their little hearts. Bless them. I mean, you know, trapping can be an option. Yeah. You know, if you want to do that, I'll use a lot of Or putting of out poison bait, but yeah. you have to be careful with yeah, that. Yeah, be careful with uh, that. Yeah, yeah because poison baits. Little, you know, house cats yeah. or whatever, and other dogs, creatures. Yeah. 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 So disturbing or a trap, you know, I would pre-bait the trap, you know, mm -hmm. let the bait stay out there for a little while. Um, you know, apple cubes, you know, mm -hmm. peanuts, peanut butter and things like that. Let yeah. them go in, in and out, in and out, and then set it. Yeah. You know, if you want to go that route. But Do you have chipmunks in your garden? We actually have chipmunks. Do you? But we have chipmunks, right. Mm. But I'm fine. I have a high tolerance level. Go get, that's good. That's <laughs> key. There yeah. Go. There you go. That is key. Yeah, so I have no problem with the chipmunks. We hope you loved the video. We would love for you to ask more questions. Be sure to leave those questions in your comments.